Howdy, it's Uncle Paul, and this is my third anniversary of being on YouTube, and we are celebrating with a subscriber hike. See, usually I'm out here by myself, and there's only one at the top. See, now I'm out here with a group of people, <laughs> and there's several waiting on us right there. I was bringing a buffet. I'm, I, I guess I'm not enough for him. That's that's encouraging. <laughs> yeah. Okay, well, we are uh, at the back end of the property. We're probably a little over halfway, around halfway done. So uh, they're, uh, they're brave going up things that I'm not willing to do right now. So, But uh, I just want to uh, have them introduce themselves and say where they're, where they're from. We'll start on this end. Hi, my name's Mike. I'm from the Fort Hood area. George from Plano. Yeah, I remember George. George has been to all my hikes so far. I'm Tammy from Lawton, Oklahoma. Chris from Ponder, Texas. Where? Ponder. Ponder, Texas. Okay. All right, guys. Well, I really appreciate you guys showing up today. Okay, we are back finally. Uh, I don't know how far we went. Uh, did, anybody, did anybody have anything? I think, I bet we went at least four miles round trip, maybe five uh, or four and a half. Like five. You think five? I bet we so. went five. Uh, so I just wanted to ask you guys what y'all thought of, we, we covered a good bit of the park. I mean, we didn't go on, a, on every trail, 
but we covered a lot of it, some diverse things. What do you have opinion on the park out here? I think it was it was a good experience. You know, great for like a little day hike. I, I like the varied terrain and Central Texas finding inclines and rocks and stuff like that. I was really surprised to see it here. Okay, so yeah, it is a little bit of a surprise. George, what do you what do you think about the trail today? It's the very terrain, I guess. So a variety of stuff. Yeah. Did you find any of it very difficult at all? Well, it's more difficult than what I'm used to, but I wouldn't say it was difficult. Right, okay, I agree. <laughs> I understand that. What about you guys? Uh, it's a great park. Uh, there's a lot of offshoot trails and different little places you can go to see other things, and the terrain varies. So some of the trails are very easy spots, and if you want to make it harder, it's not doesn't take much to find one with a little more difficulty. You know, and there's nothing just that taxing, no. you know, but you can get a decent little workout if you really oh, want yeah. to. Because oh, yeah. we, we saw a lot of people out here kind of running, yeah. <laughs> jogging and stuff. And you, I had misunderstood you earlier when we were talking, but you've uh, you've done quite a bit. You tried, you were attempting a through hike, weren't you? Yes. In 2017. Yeah. Uh, well, how did that go? It was great. Uh, started out kind of rough, uh, trying to adjust to carrying a heavy pack and up and down the hills there of course you know the elevation change on the AT is a lot more you know just going a few hundred feet and changing elevation it gets me thousands of feet. yeah and you went to, you started at Amicalola yeah I hiked the approach trail and uh, all the way to Blood okay. Mountain and you know it conditions you for the rest of the trail if you can survive Blood Mountain right how, how far did you get ultimately 788 miles without the approach trail okay and and so and you, you had to get off just from like personal. Yeah. I mean, you weren't injured no, or no. just weren't tired of it. No, I was actually getting to the park in Virginia where it's actually pretty easy. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> but you had to get off for other reasons. Yeah. So okay. Do you do you have plans to pick back up or oh, yeah. or to go or to start over or how do you want to do I, it? I think I'm just gonna start over again. Okay. Well, we really had a good time today. Um, uh, it was a, just a gorgeous day for a hike. And uh, when I got up this morning, when I first went out to walk a little bit with Hurley, uh, it was in the upper 40s. So it really felt, really felt good. And the sun was out, hard, not really a cloud in the sky. And, um, but it wasn't hot. It just wasn't a hot day. I got a red face because I think most of this came from sitting in the sun at Witch Witch Sandwich Shop. And, uh, and I wasn't under the shade of the umbrella, so, uh, but it wasn't hot, you know, it felt, it felt good. Anyway, uh, Nell got out there this morning and uh, the first one I met was, Gear, was Mike, excuse me, Mike was sitting there waiting on me. And, uh, and then George, good old George shows up. George had been on my two previous hikes and once again, he's from Plano, as he said, so he's got a long drive. And then eventually uh, Tammy and Chris showed up. So uh, so anyway, we just, they're very nice people. We just really got along and, and enjoyed enjoyed our day. We didn't, we hiked for five miles. I had my, my fitness pal with me and I figured it up. We did five miles and um, it, you know, but we took our time. We, you know, we didn't rush. We, we just enjoyed, we just enjoyed it. And we talked here and there when we, we'd rest for a while. And, uh, so it was just a really, really nice day. So I, I thank you guys so much for coming. And, uh, I gave him the gift that I had promised anyone who showed up. Uh, and I said it wasn't much, but it's the little book that I wrote and, and self-published back in 2003 bears don't eat fat people so i gave each one of them uh you know a copy of my my little book but um but then tammy and chris they they gave me a nice birthday card because tomorrow's my birthday and along with that they gave me a uh gift card to chipotle 
restaurant. So thank you guys uh, so much. I'm, I I really appreciate they all the, all of them for showing up, and just made it a wonderful day. Made it a wonderful uh, third anniversary uh, for my YouTube channel. And then when we finished, they all decided they wanted to come to the sandwich shop over there. And I, we were there at least an hour. We had to have been there at least an hour just talking. And so it was a wonderful time. So thank you guys so much. Now, tomorrow is my birthday. I'll be 52 years old. And it's, it's more convenient for the family tonight to have, you know, it, we always have the birthday meal, the birthday dinner uh for for whoever's birthday it is and tonight they asked me because because i they want it too they asked me if i wanted fajitas <laughs> so uh if i would be okay with that and it's just co more convenient to do it tonight than tomorrow being easter sunday and everything so uh i said yeah let's do it tonight i uh you know had a good hike and everything i had a good week i'm sure that i've I've lost weight this week a little bit, like the way I've been doing. So, but tonight, I'll be honest with you guys, I'm gonna splurge. I'm gonna eat fajitas. I'm probably gonna have the tortillas, and uh, you know, have some some sweet stuff, a little bit of dessert and everything. So, I don't know what the scale would say first thing in the morning after you know, uh, kind of indulging a little bit tonight. So, I'm not gonna get on the the scale in the morning. I'm just gonna end the video here and then look forward uh, to next week and getting on the scale again and uh really you know i've got like uh five weeks now five or or six weeks before i i get up to new jersey and hit the trail to, uh and, and keep making the progress that i've been making taking a little break tonight so guys thank you so much for watching as always thank you for your support and as always you know any advice that you guys have critical advice constructive criticism i always love that as well so so thank you so much thanks once again to to mike and george and tammy and chris for showing up today guys please like comment and subscribe share these videos and i will see you next week